Hello, everybody. Monty Reed here from uh, with uh, Escape from Tarkov for YouTube. And uh, today I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about uh, insurance and how it works and why. Um, let's see. It looks like I've already got these items insured. So one of the things you can do is when you're still in your stash is you can right click, go up here to insure. And if money's tight, you can go with uh, Prepor uh, insurance, but uh, the return rate is very slow. If you can afford it, uh, just pay therapist. Look at that, it's only 400 rubles more. Definitely worth it. Slow, but it's still usually within 24 hours. 12 to 24 hours. Uh, Prepor is 24 to 36 hours. And uh, if you're going to be doing a lot of runs and expect to lose a lot of gear, you might uh, vary some of your insurance from therapist to pray poor. That way, uh, 12 to 24 hours from now, you get a bunch of guns and gear back. And then 36 hours, you know, another 12 hours later, you get more. So it's just one of the ways to look at that. And uh, I like to ensure that. And you can see this uh, shield mark is on there, and it tells you who it's insured by. And um, if you try to insure your uh, container uh, when it's got things like keys, it's going to be hundreds of thousands of uh, hundreds of thousands of dollars. Let's see. So what I did is I took my rig out and I insured it separately, not insuring the key tool. So for instance, look at this: 147,000 rubles. So it might be a good idea to insure that, but I'm never going to take it out of the container, so no need to uh, insure it. Uh, and the, the reason I do this WTR rig is you see this is 3x3, three three, so a total of 9 squares. I put that in there, it gives me 2x5. Now one of the limits is there's no way to put anything that's 3 points long, so there's no way I could put this AK in there folded. Uh, so that's a problem on a run uh, where if I don't have the rig, I can put a folded up gun and a magazine in there. So that's, you know, you've got limitations and benefits. But I look at the benefit of that. Um, I can easily put an AK, you know, two of them in a small duffel. Uh, problem is, of course, if I get killed, I lose it. And the nice thing about having three spaces in your pouch is you can put stuff in there when you know you're going to die. Um, and I'm not going to toss the rig because there's this the risk of losing the keys and all that. So anyway, so you make your insurance uh, and then uh, later when uh, you are um, playing the game, you'll see a notice will come up over here in messages. And let's see, hot right item is sold. Chin up, soldier. Your insurance worked. Uh, one from this is the raid. Our guys went out to interchange and found your gear. Oh, look at that. Only a single magazine. But, you know, sometimes it's just a single magazine. And one of the reasons I will insure the magazines is I've got these two spaces full. When I reload, it's going to drop the magazine that I've got in the gun. And as long as that magazine is insured and no one finds it, then it will come back to me. And so I insure those items, and if a PMC doesn't pick it up and sell it, then it will come back. So here is uh, insurance return from another uh, raid. You can see, you just click receive all. You're going to make sure that you have room to accept everything. And uh, if you can't fit it, there's a chance you can lose it. Um, in this mode, you can't actually click and fold the stocks. Uh, sometimes I've been able to put things inside the backpack. Uh, usually it will say, no, you can't do that. But uh, I always like to make sure there's open space here so that um, you can accept it. So that's how the insurance works. If you look at some other videos of mine, you'll see uh, me getting uh, loads of gear, backpacks, and all that kind of stuff coming, coming back. So I recommend the insurance. Uh, it works sometimes. And the key thing is if you are or know that you're surrounded by scavs and you, you're pretty sure there's no players, uh, you can ditch gear in the grass and the bushes where it's less likely to be found. And if no one finds it and sells it, then you will get it back on the insurance. So this is Bunty Reed uh, for Escape from Tarkov and a little bit on how the insurance works. Let me just see if I have any more insurance here. This is just cash. 
and I've just been playing the game for 21 days, and I'm still learning how all this works, but it is a lot of fun. So I hope that you enjoy my videos. I'm just trying to pass on a little bit of what I've learned and uh, to make the game more fun for you. Thanks a lot for watching, and have a great day. I prefer thrive. Keep thriving, my friends.